Hey, Dr. F.J. Schofield with Schofield Chiropractic Training, uh, bringing you your tip of the week. We've been doing a lot of attitude headspace. Now I want to get back to the X's and O's and some technical stuff. Um, New Year, really important statistical management to measure your numbers and know. And one really important number is uh, your case average. Now what is that? Case average is essentially the lifetime value of a patient in your office. So it's what um, a new patient on average is worth to you. Now obviously there's huge variables, but it's an average. All you're going to do is you're going to take your collections, just do your monthly collections, divide it by your monthly uh, new patients, and then you'll see what your case average is or the lifetime value of a patient for you. Why is this important? Well, a lot of reasons. You need to know your numbers, but one of the big reasons is marketing. You, this is a great way to figure out what marketing is worthwhile and what marketing is not worthwhile. For instance, if you're doing a, uh, say, a workshop and you're spending, say, $3,000 on this workshop and you get one new patient and your case average is $1,500, it's not worth it. You're losing $1,500 on that workshop. Now, if you do that same workshop, it costs you $3,000, um, but you get five new patients and say your case average is $2,000, you made $10,000, so that's a $7,000 profit. Even though the workshop is an expensive event, it's well worth it. You're making money. So um, these are the little things as a business owner you have to look at to understand what's worthwhile and what's not worthwhile. And so as a marketing uh, tool, it's essential and priceless to know um, because I spend a ton of money on my search engine optimization and my internet marketing, uh, but it brings in, I make way 10 times what I put into it. So even though when I tell most chiropractors what I, I spend, they're shocked. When I go through the numbers, it's, it's well, well worth it. And so knowing my numbers allows me to make that decision and, and make sure it's a, a, a positive one. <laughs> it's going to be beneficial to my business and my family. So case average, really important, simple, uh, simple tip this week, but look at your numbers, figure it out. Um, it's very, very important to know that. And then don't, a lot of chiropractors from different areas talk about their case average. You don't want to compare. Um, cause if you have a, like for me, how am I going to compete with uh, someone in say Chicago area? They're only a few hours away, but they got blue cross and blue shield coming in paying a whole lot more than anything I'm getting. So, um, so it's going to be real easy for them to have a real high case average. Or if you're in a real low income area and someone's in a higher income area, well, they're naturally going to have a higher case average. So don't get all hung up on comparing yourself. You just want to know your numbers so you can run your business as efficiently and effectively as possible. Dr. F.J. Schofield, Schofield Chiropractic Training. Keep charging.